Hello everyone, this is Trace Renee again for Trace Hobbies and I'm still working on my Golden Demon and the concept and soon to be realized Paragon Warsuit for my character for our custom army which I've talked about in the past so I don't have to right now. Okay, I have the base pretty much designed except for like a few more par GW parts that I need and I'm getting, which are just arms. <laughs> so it looks cooler. But I have the basic design for my lava resin port base set up. So all I have to, and I've ordered the um, talcum based mix that I need to thicken the resin to help me keep it in shape and like green so when I do the resin I'm gonna mix it with paint before I pour it so to help give color to it so what I've done is used corkboard like aquarium stone and some wood putty as well to help give it shape and everything but it doesn't look anything like what i first got and if you remember it was just a simple two-layer base with skulls two demon skulls around it and easily painted now this is hopefully gonna be golden demon worthy <laughs> because that's because that's what it's going to be entered into. So, as you can see, it's. I'm hoping that it's somewhat complete. Because I don't have a turntable, so I have to do it this way. This way. And so, like, going here, I'm trying to give the full effect of it so I hope you can see the idea of the lava field in here because I going where I have it like right here come on okay you cannot like there's supposed to be you're supposed to be able to see a okay there you go this arm here I'm gonna add like Two, two to five more or something like that a few more to make it look more realistic and then I'm gonna add some skulls to it as well but from the original basing as part and you can see the mace how it is so when I have it painted I'm not sure how I'm gonna have the miniature slard or priest sitting on it okay okay this sucks I can't do it so you see I have cipher this I have multiple ways I can have it sit like this. something like this This Let's have it set up upon high. Okay. Sorry for everything. There you go. I can have it sitting upon high for even more awesomeness. I can have it standing here. Or kind of like this, where like going, the mace is going here, so like that one. That's cool. And like going, when I get back to him, I'm gonna put on my magnifying glasses and see what I need to do. Like, say, do I need to add some to that one? Because I kind of like how it flaps out like that. 
Do I need to add more heads and skulls to the back of it? Or, let's say, do I want to add some flames to his um, blade? What do I want? That's all going to come later. But, like, something that I've been thinking about is adding cables to this back skull. Which I think would look cool. Oh, well. Uh, so, this is the story that I'm telling. Okay, see. Oh, I can have him be, like... Ooh, this is an interesting way to have him sit. But one foot is back, one is front. That is actually a cool idea. Let's see. Let's see. Okay, but okay, this is how the base and the miniature looks at the moment. So, I'm probably going to add like some green stuff, some vines to the base as well, just to help make it look cool. And I'm going to be using, like I said, resin pores, talcum powder, actual talcum powder, I think, or like non-food slash beverage based powder to thicken up the resin. And then... Paints like reds, yellows, pinks, whites, um, blues, stuff to make the lava look cool and realistic and everything. And then I'm gonna use um, stone rock colors and everything to make the rocks look real. And plus, I'm gonna use crackling base crackling paint to make the rocks crack look like they're cracking and everything and make it super dry and so that's it and let's see well basically that's it for this video in the next one I'm not sure because I'm going I'm hoping that's gonna be the kit brush of my um, Grandmaster, or my Grandmaster for the commanding chap, for the commanding position of our custom chapter, which, so, I'll talk to you later then, and, oh, and sorry about the mess in my night shirt, but thank you for watching and coming, and please feel free to subscribe comment like dislike do whatever but if you comment please leave please leave a comment more than xxx or something if you have any critiques please leave those in a positive manner where i can learn from them. even if it's a bad critique it's a good it's useful when i learn from it um and let's see, that's about it. Again, this model is for 2025 Golden Demon. Um, and so please, any of the current subscribers, like the eight, nine of you, please go ahead and leave your, what you'd like to see for your named units in the chapter because we have like 10 plus units to fill out so say like 10 to 15 units to fill out in different parts which is great so that's it oh and our chapter is based on the dark angels dark angels at the moment so i'm using them as the basis and the codex to follow 
So, that's what I'm doing. Okay. Boom. So, that's it for today. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please feel free to like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you in the next one. Hopefully, I have my camera, actual camera and microphone computer setup going again. So, have a good day. Bye.